Hey YouTube, this is a review of my 1980 CB650 Honda. <coughs> it's the custom model. Custom means it's got different chrome bars and a uh, five spoke black two, uh, two rotor rims. It's actually a 626. It's got four pipes, four under two. The Kirkers. They didn't come with Kirkers or aftermarket. It's uh, it's been it's got Kirkers and it's rejetted. And uh, I just got it last year before uh, winter. It had been. I don't have a license. I don't have an endorsement or a plate yet, but I'm still riding. I don't have a. Uh, it's been sitting for about ten years. And since I've had it, I probably got twenty miles on it. It says 15057, but it's got 21 on it. I put a new cluster on it. The other one, uh, the face, the number, the face that the numbers are on was cracked, so you couldn't see the mileage or anything, and it was jacked up. So this one's been, this cluster had been in a barn, and just a couple miles ago, the tax started working. It was going real slow. It's all gummed up in the speedometer still, but uh, we'll see. Chokes right here. It's warm. It's not hot. But, uh, if you the bars, push this, turn it, it's locked, it's off, on, and park, or P, I don't know what P is, maybe power for headlock, it's got a weird gas tank, or gas cap, you put the key in it, and you twist it, and it uh, won't let you have the key back, can't take it out. So there's a black O ring. And when you push the O ring, you can't do it with one hand. There, when you push the O ring, it snaps. And that'll let you have your key back. My dad thought he broke it, but he didn't break it. To get it back in, stick the key in it, turn it, hear it pop. Yeah, I'll show you like this. Go like that. It turns. It's got a 650, as I said. Four cylinder, air cooled, custom. You know, my chrome Kirkers, I spent a couple of days detailing it before winter. Had this cover off, put a new chain on it, new sprockets, both of them. I uh, geared it up, so it's geared to do like 126. It does 50 in first. And, uh, that's just estimated from an online website. Another thing about the custom was uh, it has this right here, this shock cover. And chrome shocks, most of them just add just shocks. Got new tires. Well, I didn't put them on, but they're newer. I'm only going to have this bike for a little while. I'm going to uh, maybe a 1200 Sportster here in the next week or two. Found what I want. It's real clean. It's a 04, 7,000 miles. Red. The guy wants a 55. I'll buy it for four. Hopefully. I don't know, Sportster or maybe a Road King. My dad's got a Screaming Eagle Road Glide. You know, the horn doesn't work. I don't know why I pulled the fuse box and the fuses are all there, but I don't know. It's got pegs. I have a sissy bar and a pole bar at home, but the guy had rigged this bolt right here with a bunch of washers, and I'm trying to find the other one, and it's like 20 bucks from online, and I'm not paying 20 bucks for a bolt. Start it up here. No choke. It's just blowing smoke because it's still the tank with stable in it.
clean bike though for 32 years old. You want to find a tag? Alright, there'll be more videos to come. I'll make a ghetto helmet cam later on. Thanks for watching.